Hello, this is Hara, and I want to have an interview with you guys about the theater group, the Curtain Riser Productions. So I know you guys in charge of this group, so I want to know, get some information from you guys, okay? And first, I will take a record, and this is not for, this is not for commercial situation, and just use for the research. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Um. Please, uh. First, uh, please. First question is: I want you guys introduce yourself. Introduce sure. yourself. Um. Maybe uh, Mr. Ali. Uh, my name is Mohammed Ali Farooqi. Mm. I'm currently doing PhD from Kailasam University in mm. Punjab University, mm. and uh, I'm founder of this group, the Curtain Razor, mm. and uh, I've been part of university drama you know drama team and i've been mm. president for like i would say four years mm. and uh, we participated all across country from karachi to kashmir we have uh, are done numerous theater productions uh, from our from the platform of our, of our university and even uh, we've done a theater on uh, for you know amateur basis i'll be ngos ngos and uh, I guess we haven't done uh, commercial theatre. Yeah, haven't done commercial theatre. Yes, we haven't done that, but we have done projects with, uh, with certain yeah. organizations. You mean that interviews. kind of commercial theatre, like a uh, performance uh, in the middle night, that kind of, or you know, no, we haven't performed uh, it commercially. Oh, commercially. Mm -hmm. Yes, we all we uh, all theatre we have done like before this. We, it was all you know. Uh, not for profit purpose. It was theater oh, for the sake theater, of theater. For education or theater oh, for right. awareness kind of oh, stuff. Got it, got yeah, it. But we have plans that we'll perform it. We'll perform theater to So can you tell me something about that? Uh, and like uh, how old are you about uh, your education background about theater? I'm 27 years old and um, my education background is that uh, I've been a historian from intermediate level uh i read history in my intermediate then bachelor's then master's then mp then now i'm doing phd in punjabi theater uh and about my theater background i've been in industry for like uh, past eight years mm -hmm. and my start uh, theater career start was uh, started from my university uh, i was uh, in normal university doing my ma english masters in english literature and language Mm -hmm. uh, there I started to perform uh, a bit skits, then I became president of Kaidazm University Drama Club. Then uh, there is a whole journey there. At that time, how old are you? At that age? Mm -hmm. I would say uh, 20 probably. 20? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. it, and uh, um, now we have switched to, you know, we're not performing theatre regularly mm -hmm. due to past COVID as in as you and current, uh, you know, recession period, economic crisis, uh, we are, uh, theater industry has faced many problems for past like two or two years, I would say, mm -hmm. uh, especially from COVID. And there was a, a huge issue for us to bring audience to an auditorium. Yeah. And there was uh, restrictions for us, uh, for even uh, we see concerts and stuff, but theater uh, re to revive theater that was a very challenging job but currently there are, we can see uh, some progress some uh, positive stuff happening for example there was a recently uh, concluded trauma festival in Rawalpindi Arts Council mm -hmm. the twin twin city of Islamabad Rawalpindi uh, there was a major activity in Islamabad and there was a commercial theatre by, you know, uh, by Theatre Wale. Uh, there was also included, I, I believe, last week or uh, another last week. Anyhow, uh, it is a slow progress right now. And uh, I guess people are going to as revive theatre, but quite slowly and gradually. Okay. Um, what do you just said now? I I find you have mentioned uh, commercial theater for two times. So I want to know what's the meaning of commercial theater in your opinion? 
Uh, in commercial theater, uh, we bring audience uh, on, you know, ticket basis. Oh, ticket. Yes, people come and watch. They pay for uh, ticket, you know, and watch your drama. But uh, and we involve. But you know, actually, profession, 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 profession theater, all over the world. If you want to see the theater, audience should buy the tickets. This is very normal. No, we don't have that. Uh, culture in Pakistan. Oh, don't yes, we do have. Uh, oh. We do have commercial theatre here. Oh, so but, it means but normally Pakistan, people don't like to invest much in theatre. You know. I got your point. You mean in Pakistan they don't have a culture. If people want to go to see the theatre in the theatre place, usually they were not in charge of the audience. It means no no need to buy tickets. If That's, if if they take money from either the audience to buy the tickets so it means this kind of theater is means commercial theater yes yes she is asking you when you think a people come to the theater after getting the tickets if, you, if, if she is if paying the audience need to buy the tickets yeah. then they belong to commercial theater yes yes, yes that is the commercial or is when they have it to not belong to commercial theater yes yes okay please continue um we do have um good production houses here who are doing commercial theater for a long time and we have a long history of commercial theater in Lahore, in Karachi. That's not uh, the problem that we don't have culture, we do have. Mm -hmm. But uh, currently, mm -hmm. currently a commercial theater is not happening in Pakistan except, except Lahore. Mm -hmm. Because Lahore has a different kind of audience, they are, you know, uh, that Punjabi theater uh, okay. in in Lahore uh, auditoriums or theater halls with dance and uh, all that stuff. It is uh, it is happening regularly, but only entertainment. But on yes, only uh, you know uh, restricted to that part. But commercial theater that is uh, more thematic, that is uh, more rich in theatrical. Uh, you know skills and uh, it's in, in practices that is not currently happening in Pakistan. Mm -hmm. Only uh, restricted theater, that is not restricted. I would say only uh, entertainment theater of Lahore. You know Punjabi theater that is uh, currently happening. Okay, I got your point, but I also have a question for what you just said now. Uh, you said after COVID nineteen. Mm, the situation about your group is not so good as others' theater as well, yes. And I, um, I'm, you mentioned your theater group was founded in uh, um, 2019? 2017. Oh, 17. Oh, 2017. 2017 it was founded. And that means 2019 or 2000, 2020. The COVID nineteen is coming to Pakistan. Yes. Yes. So, from what time your theater group suffered from the COVID nineteen, the confirmed time? Can you tell me? Hmm. The thing is that uh, in Pakistan we had you know regular theater festivals. Uh, uh, yes. Teams would go there and participate mm -hmm. and perform. Mm -hmm. But after COVID, uh, all festivals were banned or you know they were stopped. Mm -hmm. They were not happening regularly. And uh, we did try to do a little commercial activity in in Islamabad, and we did pull some audience of you know a few hundred, I would say. A few hundred. Uh, three, four hundred. Yeah, and that was two in COVID. Yes, that was yeah. all before COVID. Uh, I think after the third um, show, uh, the, that was the COVID. Show. I want to know the confirmed time when the children uh, suffered from the, the I'll COVID nineteen. I have to check the dates, uh, otherwise you can also check it from uh, our Facebook page. Uh, we have maybe uh, like uh, 2020 or 2019. Uh, we had uh, did our last performance maybe in 2021. 2021. In 2020. 2021. In 2021. Yeah. No, even after 2021, uh, we had done our uh, last performance and uh, there was uh, in low pizza. Low pizza and there was I'm 2022. Talking about, I'm talking about um, theater. Mm -hmm. Theater performance. There I guess in, in before COVID. 
come in the auditorium and when they watch when they uh, experience your drama when they uh, watch it they go with a message and they um, they meet us afterwards and they say that uh, you have changed our lives and you have changed our um, you know perception about certain things and we have done uh, work on very bold topics in our theatre production for example uh, we've uh, done performances on prostitution we have uh, brought up the issue of partition in our dramas we have uh, uh, we have discussed domestic violence we have discussed child abuse we have discussed sexual abuse in our dramas even we have uh, uh, the the drama which I got um, from where I got uh, best actor award Alif Iqbal that was on child literacy you know so we have uh, done work on quite uh, you know bold topics and uh, were these topics that that should be discussed in our society yeah it's, it's mean except uh, except uh, you want to educated people. And I want to know why you choose theater. Because uh, if you want to educate the people, they have many ways, yes? yes? Not only you can be a teacher, you can do education very directly. Why you choose but, uh, theater? Yes. Uh, when I started to perform theater, it became my passion. I, I, passion. Just, love, oh, okay. I just love to be on stage. But mm -hmm. um, why theater? Why the, uh, theater for education? Theater is one of the strongest mediums to express yourself mm. all right you uh, you bring change among mm. people directly they watch you they they are inspired by you okay? yeah so that is the thing that inspired me most that you can uh, you can change people's per perception mm. in in you know in in one hour you can just perform and uh, let them observe it uh, by I, themselves i can understand so yeah. this is a very strong expression of of yourself of okay. whatever you want uh, you want to express oh so uh mr imran Khan. yes fine. um nice to meet you and uh, you know you also as a regular num a member of uh, this uh, uh cultural productions group so you as a regular playwright yes ali said when he was on the stage he feel that he can, he can, uh, he have a passion, and he also like the feeling, and he also uh, inspired people. He feels very good, and uh, I want to know first, uh, how about how how is your feeling when your position, your scripts on stage? Yeah, thank you so much, Kara. Mm -hmm. uh, so far as I concerned, uh, I did this. I started started this journey almost uh, when I was a student of intermediate. Um, um, I wanted to be a doctor. I, I, I was a student I, of. Sorry, I did, uh, At yes. that time, what, how old are you? Uh, I'm thirty eight years old. I, I said at that time. At that time, I was I, I was just I think uh, 14, uh, 14? 18 years old. Eighteen. Uh, Eighteen years, years old. Yes. Mm. And uh, at that time. Uh, I started writing when I was just uh, nine or ten years old. I wrote my first poem, mm -hmm. and later on, uh, when I got a break in my studies, uh, not break in the sense that I, I had a break uh, so far as uh, the cancellation of the studies. Mm -hmm. uh, the break means I then I switched my uh, studies from uh, science to uh, art to mm -hmm. literature. So, what time? Uh, I so think uh, in my intermediate after my intermediate. Intermediate. Yes, I Maybe started at, at your yes, what I, age? Uh, that was the 20, 20, 20 years old, I think. I 20? Was 20, uh, 20, years 20 years old, old you yes, shaped the uh, science to art. Yes, art. Uh. And that was the time when I got impressed by Lil Fisher. Mm -hmm. uh, from my childhood, we, uh, uh, we, all the brothers and sisters, we were really fond of uh, uh, reading stories and all that. Mm -hmm. And uh, I can guess that uh, when I was just uh, 15 or 16 years, so I, I used to imagine myself. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, uh, while writing, while mm. uh, doing all these uh, literary activities. Mm. Then uh, later on, uh, Ali's father, he's mm. my teacher, uh, yeah. uh, he's my morsha as well. So it was his advice that I must uh, have a speech towards uh, literature, from science oh, to literature. literature. Okay. Yes, and then I did my bachelor's, bachelor's in literature. And from there, I started uh, uh, aspiring myself as a writer, first as a poet, and then later on as a, 
as a dramatist and as a fiction writer. And when I joined uh, the GCU Lahore, Government College University Lahore, as yes. my as as an ample student, so yes. from where I got this uh, love and passion for theater because uh, yeah. my class fellow he was the president of QD, uh, of GCDC, mm. and later on my another class fellow became the mm. in charge of uh, GCDC, mm. and from them I have learned a lot. And uh, uh, after doing many dramas from GCDC, performed by GCDC, and uh, certain other dramas from Lahore. Uh, I got developed a kind of love for that, and then uh, from where I started writing play, that was again Ali. Mm -hmm. Ali was the president of uh, Kaizazam University, mm -hmm. and uh, he asked me to write a drama. Mm -hmm. he, he said, okay, well, he? "Yes, Ali." He what time? Me. Maybe at what time? Uh, I was a student of. Uh, I did my MPhil at that time, uh -huh. and I think that was uh, I was probably twenty-eight years old. 28. Yes. 20, uh, 16 there. Uh, yes, 2016. I think I was 20, 26. Yes, I 20, 28 no, no. years old I was. And that was 2016. 2016? Yes, then when I wrote my first and play for theatre. GCU. I was the teaching at the Arts and College at that time. And I was doing my MPhil from GCU. Yes. Uh, I did my MPhil at that time. I did my MPhil in 2013. And then I was teaching at uh, the Arts and College Lahore when Ali requested me to write a drama. And I wrote that drama, but uh, unfortunately, uh, for, unfortunately, that wasn't performed because uh, I didn't have that view okay, how to write for the theater. Yes, how and to write for the stage. For the stage, theater, the stage yes. yes. It's different. I wrote a drama, but that couldn't be performed. And then Ali asked me to come and uh, watch the dramas with him. Mm -hmm. uh, they were there, I think, in uh, All Partisan All Partisan Arts 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 Festival. Tha. We I took, took him with us and. Uh, there were dramas from all over the country. So what, uh, which year? That was, I think, in uh, G G I K Lahore. Uh, G I K Topai. What? So, so Abhi. So Abhi. K P K. K P K. K P K. What and is K P K? Yes, it's, it's a province. Province of Pakistan. Province. Northern province of Pakistan. What time? On which year? Uh, 2016. 2016. 2016 or 17. 16 or 17. Early 17 or 16. 17, I would say. It means 2016, you two met each other together. We had already known each other, but no. that was the time when we started working on theater together. Yes, I got it. He was the president of the drama theater. We used to write, I know, we used to write poems and uh, uh, I would say uh, short stories. Yes, I. Uh, but then I asked him to write for theater as well. Mm. Before that time, I was writing uh, poetry and poetry. Uh, yeah, fiction. Which but, kind of poetry? Punjabi uh, poetry or something? Punjabi, English, and Urdu. Obviously. English, Urdu? Yes. Also? Uh, oh. Yes. I write in English. Uh, I'm writing Punjab uh, theater uh, in Urdu and Punjabi. So and, I want uh, to know, you, you actually, you influenced by literature too much. Which kind of literature you like most? Uh, the literature? A literature, yes. Uh, writing literature, or, or, reading literature. Or doing uh, literature or English literature or something. Uh, I write poetry in English. Poetry in English. Fiction in English. Uh. And uh, drama in Urdu and Punjabi. Drama in yeah. Urdu and Punjabi. We haven't explored uh, English theater. English theater, yeah, we haven't explored. Because of no demand. <laughs> we, could, we could do English theater. We but, can, uh, but uh, 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 we don't have demand for that. Uh, so now you must uh, write the Urdu theater. Yes, uh, we are writing Urdu theater. So all the sc your scripts is about the English language, uh, the Urdu language. We have written almost seven to eight uh, Urdu dramas, and we have performed them as well. How much? Eight, seven or eight dramas. Seven, seven or eight. Seven or eight dramas. We had seven or eight. We have written oh. that, and we have performed them as well. We have a Punjabi play as well. And three out of them are Punjabi, I think, and the five are Urdu play. Three in three are Punjabi. Punjabi. Yes, and uh. five are Urdu. Five in Urdu. Yes. No English. Uh, no English right now. But we. So I want to know the script is a primary or just the adaptation? No, uh, we have written all of the dramas primary. Uh, we don't. Primary. Have, we, have we have never adapted. We have uh, yes, we had uh, adapted Dr. one play, Dr. Slavudin. That was an adaptation of Dr. Uh, Faustus, uh, written uh, by Christopher Marlowe. Uh, that was an adaptation. Other than that, we have written all of the dramas by. Means awesome. all the all, all the primary drummers so they are the written primary. by they are written by me. Written by him. Yes, all of uh, those dramas are written. And by you me. are the he is a director. director. He is the director. Uh, and who the producer. Who will be the producer? Uh, he is a producer. Producer. Yes. Where where who are supporting you? Uh, to produce dramas. You you know if you want to do rehearsal, 
you want uh, the same on the stage. Yes, yeah, so let me tell you, you uh, need... all of this is backed up by Ali's father. He is the Ali's father. Yes, he is the chairman of. Uh, oh, this uh, is the real yes. boss. <laughs> <laughs> he is the uh, he is the chairman and uh, uh, CEO. We could sure say that. Yeah, chairman. Like a CEO at your group. He is no. the chairman of the whole mm-hmm. and uh, organization that under we, which we are running. Organization. Yes. Oh. Um. Yes. Azim 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 education. education conference. Oh. That is the um, uh, parent organization. Parent organization. This is this is magazine. This is magazine is. Magazine is also the part a, of that organization. This is mainly about what? This magazine. Mm. This is magazine. What is mainly about? It, it is information based. Right? Information. Yes, yeah, yeah, it's primarily for you. For use. Yes, primarily. Basically, let me tell you the whole structure. Um, we are having an organization with the name Azim Education Conference. Yeah. That organization was uh, founded by Ali's father back um, in two thousand almost. Two thousand. Yes. yes, in two thousand. The guys told me yes. almost uh, 20, twenty-two years. Uh, yes. And uh, under that organization, we are having certain uh, other uh, things to do. Projects. Uh, projects. We are mm-hmm. having uh, a theater group. Mm-hmm. Under that organization, we are having. Uh, uh, we are uh, publishing a, a magazine under that mm-hmm. organization, and uh, we, we have, have a research journal. Uh, research journal, well. uh, you know, Culture. we have uh, Al Fawzul Azim Quran Academy, and there are um, dozens of branches across the country. Across the country, and uh, we are also going for a, you know, um, and a university project that will make a university in future. Inshallah. Uh-huh. And uh, we have quite so uh, projects in our pipeline. You mean you didn't get any support from the government? Maybe did. Right now we are doing it. Right now we don't have, but uh, we have uh, collaborated different projects with government organizations, with private NGOs as well. We have had their support. But the private, and not uh, from the government. No, it's not from the government. Um, not yes, we had, but we did have. Uh, 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 we have done certain uh, programs which were sponsored by the government. Oh. Yes, we have done work with ministries, you know, in oh. the environment, in ministry, kind of stuff. So most we, of the support is come from your father. Yes, most of the uh, mostly uh, not uh, financially, I would say, mm. uh, but mostly uh, because of his support that uh, we are sitting in this studio, you know. This studio who yeah. help you to? Yeah, we can we use it for our, our TV channels. TV channels. All of these three uh, uh, offices that we are mm-hmm. serving. Uh, three office. offices. Three offices. Uh, no, we, we also have another one. We oh. also have just into that. These okay. three offices are uh, uh, are given to us by his father oh. to work for that. This is by your baba. Yes. yes. Oh. All of these things that comes from. Mm. So, uh, so far as the theater is concerned, uh, I told you when we came to theater, though. Mm. We too came to theater with a purpose, as he told you. Came we want to educate, mm-hmm. um, educate not in the purpose that we want to give them certain lessons. Uh, mm-hmm. The thing is, that theater, as you are working on theater, mm-hmm. you are working on the development of theater. Yes. So theater throughout history has remained a very vital organ, um, uh, a vital organism. You can say organization, a yeah, vital uh, instrument, a vital tool to educate the people. So far as the social and uh, Economic, social economic, social political issues of the society are concerned. It's it's really very helpful to uh, tell the people what is going on, and uh, it's really very helpful to raise certain questions for the audience. And because audience and characters and actors, they have a very uh, close contact during uh, these uh, theatrical uh, uh, the performances. So uh, it's really a vital tool to uh, infuse into their minds. We we think. It's a very vital tool to infuse into the minds of the spectators to think about certain issues which are going on around in society. So that's why we tried, we decided to work uh, together on this, uh, on on uh, so far as theater is concerned, and we want to revitalize the things which are running in our society. Uh, we want to uh, put it forward for the youth. We want to bring youth in connect in connection with the with this art. And we, uh, through this youth and through this art, we want to bring a change into our society mm-hmm. to the extent we can. Mm-hmm. So, uh, we are not saying that we would change the whole society, but to the extent we can do something, we would do. And uh, all those motives which we have to uh, do, uh, you can say, okay, to modify the society mm-hmm. or uh, do something for the society, we would do that. Mm-hmm. Because for the sake of reformation, criticism is always good. We should do criticism for the sake of reformation. 
mm-hmm. and uh, it has always happened in societies uh, not here and um, it has been done by the century um, and again centuries old it has been done by the europeans and all that it has been done by the greeks and we are doing the same thing and uh, so far as the history of the theater is concerned we have not took mm-hmm. centuries back mm-hmm. to mahabharata and all that so we want to revive all those traditions mm-hmm. unfortunately in pakistan theater is not uh, up to the mark right now matlab uh, there are certain theater groups which are working but only few we you can uh, count them on fingers fingertips but uh, we want to revitalize it it's something very useful and uh, we want to deliver it to the uh, to the youth of the pakistan okay? they must come and they must take something out of it and they must prevail to the society so this is our purpose to do and hopefully we are doing and we would do good something yes i i i find your words i can see that this is your hobby this is your love yeah. this is your passion and this is your hobby and this is what you that is it's your desire you want right now do. we are doing it for the sake of aesthetics for the sake of a promotion mm-hmm. and for the sake of that education which we have taken from our teachers we want to mm-hmm. transfer it to the rest of the people mm-hmm. i mean uh, right now we uh, till date we are not involved into any commercial activity mm-hmm. and uh, if in future we would do the commercial theater mm-hmm. so that would be done with a purpose not without any purpose yes if you want to do actually theater in not only in pakistan in every country in yes. all over the world on um, youth theater for survival is very difficult yeah. so i want to know except the theater these groups did you have for other regular work job yeah. yeah so what is your job uh, i'm doing uh, i'm a teacher basically i'm a teacher of literature uh-huh. in federal government college um, islamabad Islamabad. Uh, the name of my college is uh, Islamabad Model Postgraduate College, Islamabad. Uh. That is for the boys, and I'm uh, assistant professor there. Uh. I'm doing my PhD from Khyber University, and uh, I'm doing PhD on Punjabi resistance poetry against British Raj. Mm. I'm doing my PhD from uh, uh, history department of Khyber University, mm. and my basically the uh, uh, it's uh, South Asian history. Mm. Uh, so, Ali. Now you are a PhD student, yes. Yes, I am. A uh, except that you are a PhD student, except that you are the direct director of this uh, theater group. Did you do any other job or any no, other stuff? I don't do uh, anything except that. Oh. Uh, but I do projects with TV channel. TV channel. Yes. Oh, TV channel. What? Which TV? PTV. I've done work with PTV. ATV. ATV. And ATV. whole life, uh, online. We've been on K two as well. Uh, yes, we had went for K two as well. Oh, uh, you you help them to do shooting or something? Yes, shooting. Yes, yes. I'm I'm a producer. A producer. Yes, yes. basically we produce certain uh, programs for these TV channels. So and, you uh, earn money from from this commercial uh, work. Yeah. Then put the money into the theater or yes, stuff. whatever we earn, we put that we put into there. But the uh, uh, so for as uh, Uh, till date concerned we are not earning much out of those pro- uh, uh, those projects but we are doing those projects to keep ourselves busy into this uh, line and we want to progress in future mm-hmm. so that's why we are doing that and uh, almost we have done 100 programs mm-hmm. uh, with our channel uh, i'm hosting mm-hmm. that program and ali's father is a prominent guest of that program yeah. so and uh, we had done almost 30 30 or 60 programs with atv as well and yes. ali's father had Uh, those are the series of the two programs, uh, uh, and those were uh, all taken yeah, by sixty programs, I think. And so, then, uh, so I want to know now, now, how many people, how many members in your in your theater group um, regularly? I don't, uh, I don't, I haven't really um, counted as much, but when. It depends upon our project when we. It depends upon the project. When I mean, how many I mean regularly. We, regular, a, we have regular, you know, I would say ten to twelve ten people. Ten to twelve. Ten to twelve. Yes, they are the regular part. Ten to twelve. Yes, yes. They are the regular members of the program, and when according to the project, you if we pay need for them. Have, No, 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 no. We all are doing it as our own. Volunteer. Yes. Oh, no one. Um, no one you gets. You wanted to do. As I told you, okay, we are doing theater for the sake mm. of uh, a reformation, for the sake of uh, aesthetic pleasures only. All of the can, uh, members of the program of the theater, they don't uh, earn, mm. and we don't pay them. We don't pay them. 
it's uh, all voluntarily they work for the organization voluntarily yes if sometime if we get some money so we uh, give them uh, we, share we share it with uh, them if yeah. you got a money you share with them share or it. volunteer yes yeah. it's it's all voluntary it's simple no and sometimes we have to pay by our own pockets mm -hmm. when we go for certain projects for the public yes, because masses, you have job yes we, uh -huh. we do it for the public so sometimes to do it for the public we pay from our own pay a pockets. little bit yes we, uh, we pay to survive our, yes oh got it so uh, i want to know most of the members uh, education level yes phd i am here PhD or all? It means all the, all the members like the students. They are the students of research. Oh. They are either the students of MPhil or the students of PhD. And if there are certain, so they are the students of BS level. I mean, means, all of we all them. Are, we are all are students, students of research. Oh. And the student founded body, you will, uh, when you go to our website, the first sentence you will read it. A student, student founded body. Mm -hmm. All of the members of the uh, uh, of this group, they are the students. So that is will be a very young group. Yes, they are yeah, very young. The group. young, two kinds of meaning. First is uh, founded very young. Yeah. Second is uh, all the members there is very young. Yes, they are the students. Oh. Yes. So I want to know how do you think about of uh, the whole development of uh, develop of uh, Pakistani culture and how do you think about the Islam Islam bird Islam birds culture de develop Islam birds first the, the whole country and then, and then about the Islam bird in yeah, your uh, you're talking in, about in young people's theater. eyes it's all about contemporary theater I, I just want to know because you know usually when I go to visit people or after Actually, they are in very old age. Yes. But you know, children, yes, all the people, they know many things. They know history, they know future, they know many things. But you know, if the children want to go going on, they need a teenager, they need a young people yes. like you, like me, like uh, all your groups. So young people is very important. Yeah. This group is very young, yes. made of young people. And still, uh, founded in a very young time. So uh, so I want to know in all your, your, your age, how do you think about the Pakistani theater situation, and how do you think about the, the situation of uh, Islamabad theater? Uh, so far as uh, the development mm -hmm. of theater in Pakistan is concerned, uh, uh, Ali is working on Punjabi theater, mm -hmm. and he is talking about the theater after the pers uh, in the perspective of. Uh, uh, Punjab's uh, so division in 1947. Mm. Uh, theater has very strong roots in India, mm. right from Mahabharata onward. Mm. But uh, unfortunately, uh, during the colonial period, mm. uh, because the, the whole nation, mm. the, whole, the whole India, it was uh, in a tussle with the British Raj. So, so can you use one word or one sentence to conclude, conclude, to conclude the situation, the whole country? Yes. So far as Pakistan is concerned, much has been done, but much is there done. to be done. Much is done. there to be done. Much done. It's much done, but much is more much is there to be done. Certain uh, theater groups are working on theater. They are doing much uh, good, but uh, there are certain many things that we have to uh, to regenerate and to retransform. And we are working on that. We we uh, we have decided to work on that, and mm -hmm. I think. Many other theater groups, uh, uh, they are working on that. And you would find many young theater groups here in Pakistan right now. They are, they are yes, 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 I can see yes, that. They are working on. So, so far as the youth is concerned, they must come towards this art. They must uh, have this art as a tool and they must propagate what they can so, uh, uh, throughout the society about mm -hmm. the socio-political and socio-religious uh, environment around the society. And uh, uh, yes, you, you are very right. The youth can play a very vital part to do that because uh, they can do uh, they can took the uh, what has been done by their predecessors they can took it to the next level and uh, we came to this uh, uh, profession we came to this field with this uh, aim to do it to do something good which has already been done so uh, the certain other groups are doing the same thing and they must come uh, but i believe uh, 
the main you know foundation of any discipline or genre for example theater uh, it is a youth but unfortunately uh, youth theater which is based upon student theater i believe that, that is on decline uh, a few years ago when we were part of student theater i i could remember uh, regular drama festivals and you know with with a huge number of participating team but those festivals which were you know famous for huge uh, crowd pulling uh, tradition and a major number of drama groups university drama groups uh, they lack teams now like those festivals which used to have 14 or 15 dramas they only have two or three drama per participation teams can you imagine in a few years i would say two or three years nahi balki uh, i would say ke four to five years we have come to this that uh, uh, for example i'll give you an example there is a all pakistan performing arts festival it's been uh, organized for like past 24 years all right uh, we went there on 19th 19th yeah or 18th all pakistan drama festival and there were uh, i guess 10 or 12 teams in that competition we won that but uh, i get uh, among last month i'm not telling you last month i went there as a judge or right. we participated in uh, in its upcoming uh, two other festivals as well we won that too uh, but in latest festival there were 22nd all pakistan drama uh, performing arts festival um, i was just there and there were only three teams um i could i was very you know uh, sad and uh, worried to see situation that the very ma- major foundation of our theater there was uh, you know um, carried by our student theater our students or youth um, they are not part i would want to add something ara especially this theater uh, this uh, festival which ali is mentioning uh, it was after covid and uh, it might be a reason out of many reasons it might be a reason because of the covid the teams were not prepared they were not fit, they were not ready mm-hmm. to participate in this event so might be in next year there might be certain few teams as well but overall the situation is really worst and that is because the students they are not getting favor mm-hmm. they are not getting favor from the university authorities they are not getting favor from the public Uh, because a favor. The, no, because no. Uh, like, I have faced many uh, issues with my uh, teachers, my supervisor. That why are you doing theater? <laughs> Leave it. Uh, all, uh, this, this is one of the reasons. The theater groups to whom you have met, uh, Ajoka and all that, they are well sponsored. They don't have the issues for financing. Yeah. They are. They don't have the issues, so that's why they are performing it well uh, regularly and all that. The theater groups like we. uh it's always very tough to perform because we it needs uh, uh it needs a lot of things ali is a producer so he needs how much finances are involved to bring the character actors mm-hmm. to send them back for their rehearsals and all that so we need money mm-hmm. and the ta- i mean we can extract from ourselves a bit money and out of that we can perform twice or thrice in a in a year but if we want to perform on a regular basis we need sponsors and we don't get that sponsors So, so overall, in 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 our um, uh, so far as the Pakistan theatre, the argument of Pakistan theatre is your topic. So, in Pakistan, the theatre groups, almost all the theatre groups, they are not getting that support from the masses, from the public, from other authorities. Even government, even government is even not government, patronizing. Uh, uh, government is not patronizing so, theatre, especially youth. Um, even the festival I was referring to you that was included of you. Uh, uh, a two week uh, i guess two a couple three of weeks, weeks ago yes, three weeks ago uh there was supposed to be a youth festival <laughs> and then i got the invitation and went to see the, <laughs> there was a uh, no young guy in the in whole drama mm. there were old you know uh, babe <laughs> senior guys who were performing who don't want to leave here who don't want to make space for you you know they were doing that i was like that festival they were supposed to be for youth so it is uh, you know uh, so far as the youth is concerned they have their talent 
they are brilliant enough they have the potential and because we uh, the whole of our group that is based on youth and we have very good talent with us and they can do good performances and they can write well but uh, the thing is the uh, the same is the thing that we won't get all that we need for this uh, to promote it so development would be there development would be there if we find a suitable atmosphere and uh, for that atmosphere we are working we are working we are striving we are striving we are striving we are struggling for that we are doing and we are doing with and our own pockets and hopeful well. i don't know about people but i believe in me that i will um, uh, one day we will pull a great uh, production house and you know yesterday we chinese will be proud of Mm-hmm. Uh, we started this journey three years earlier. I mean, specifically the journey that belongs to us. Mm-hmm. We were uh, we are doing theater since two thousand sixteen or seven two two thousand fifteen. Ali is doing two thousand since two thousand fifteen, and I am I am with him two thousand sixteen. Mm-hmm. We are working uh, together. We are doing the, the same thing, and we had decided to do this. And uh, no doubt, K until this time we have uh, faced many difficulties, uh, financial. And not only the financials, other social safe, uh, problems are there, but we are still confident enough. We are uh, working against all these uh, problems and all that. And hopefully, in future, um, you can find you. You have I mean, is the uh, studio where you are sitting. Uh, we have done this, and in near future, we will do more than this. Inshallah, uh, right. we are hopeful. Uh, so far as the development is concerned, we are hopeful that we will do so. Uh, we not only we. We means the whole youth of the Pakistan. Yes, they would do no boundaries. Uh, yes, they would do something mm-hmm. good for.